Hey everybody, this is DM Mike, and this is the next soundtrack recommendation uh, for your D&D or fantasy campaign, whatever you're running, if it's fantasy-based. Uh, usually I do gameplay kind of videos uh, for this, so you just hear my voice narration, but you know, YouTube is just so unpredictable nowadays. Um, you never know when it's going to be too much, so I'm going to kind of get rid of that format for the time being. I'm just going to go ahead and recommend this album to you. It's two albums, actually, and it's going to be Vermitide and Vermitide 2. I think a majority of these albums, I think maybe all of it, is done by Jesper Kide or Jesper Kid. Probably saying his name wrong, as I do always. Uh, but this is a very, this is a stellar, stellar soundtrack. It's really good if you're running a campaign that has a lot of goblins, orcs, uh, kobolds. Uh, if it has a lot of uh, gnolls or skaven or, you know, kind of rat, the rats. I can't remember what they're called in D&D. &D. But um, this is great for that kind of stuff. Uh, uh, if you have these little minions running around everywhere. Uh, I've used it in several radio dramas uh, for Rise of Tiamat and Horror the Dragon Queen is kind of the background music for my stuff. Uh, but, you know, every time I listen to this stuff, it just reminds me of orcs and it reminds me of goblin tribes and gnolls scouting out the prairie as they go hunt down their prey. It's really good for this kind of stuff. Um, and also there's, there's some great combat music. If you're curating your music and trying to make some good combat music, uh, battle music, there's quite a few tracks here that would work for that. But if you like to do like little tiny mini cutscenes at the table, they don't really affect a lot of gameplay. They're not right in the middle of combat or something that's crazy or just that inter in, kind of interrupts player ability or agency. There's a lot of great tracks here that you can do that and I've used this so many times just so many so many times it's up there with my dark sider soundtrack of being used almost all the time uh, dark void dark siders and of course vermintime and vermintime 2 I just used vermintime 2 uh, in dragons of ice Pirate peak uh, just last week so it's great stuff so just keep that in mind if you're running uh, if you want to introduce some goblins orcs kobolds you know name your typical little tiny minions running around uh, this is like some great great music some of it's really bombastic and there's a lot of weird instruments ha uh, being used in these tracks which gives your those creatures this kind of alien feel all right so it works perfectly for that so go pick them up i think you can only get these digitally uh, they're available just about anywhere i don't know what the price point is but it's totally worth it guys so go check it out all right guys that's it see you in the next one